Monica Garcia is out in Sun City tonight. Uh, it was super windy on the northwest side of town. Some damage was done, Monica. Yeah, it's hard to believe how calm it is. It's chilly that all of this happened two hours ago. And I will tell you that, I mean, this entire neighborhood was hit pretty badly. A perfect example of it is this person's backyard. Now, I'm told this house is currently under escrow. So whoever bought this house is going to have a lot of damage to clean up. You're looking at this person's uh, backyard. I'm told this was a beautiful gazebo uh, right here in the patio. As you can see right now, it's a lot of damage. It's really just crumpled up. And I know that there's some wires that are hanging, though. We believe those to be cable wires, but we're going to keep our distance from that. Uh, yes, I'm told that it was a veteran who owned this house for many years, and he decided to pack up just a couple of days ago and moved to Texas. And he found a buyer and was really happy. And I can tell you, uh, neighbors throughout the area have been cleaning up for this guy who's not home. And I know that you were just looking at the roof, uh, the air conditioning unit blown completely out of its spot and then along the side of the house this is what was thrown all over the neighborhood uh, there was one guy that was dragging these awnings these metal awnings uh, from about a block down and they say it sounded like a tornado when that storm came rolling through about two hours ago take a listen to what neighbors say started off as a pretty nice day it was like really nice out and the next thing you know that it, it, it was like it came from behind and just came like so fast it was like here like within seconds and it just boom and it hit and then you can hear everything like cracking and breaking and flying through the air and all of a sudden i heard this noise you know it's like mumbling and everything else i couldn't believe it's like a monsoon going through it scared me it did scare me you know what i mean yeah, and that was Jimmy Doyle. He lives just across the street. His entire roof was peeled off in a matter of seconds. But let me just tell you, to give you an example of some of the damage in the neighborhood, look at this tree here. We pulled up, and this is every other house seems to have some sort of tree or vegetation just completely uprooted. Neighbors have been outside kind of just talking amongst each other, helping one another clean up. And a lot of them just saying, you know, hey, thank God there were no injuries. But everybody was scared out here. I mean, when they say it rolled through, it was just so loud and obviously you can see right there causing a lot of damage but as we said thankfully nobody was injured but that's what it looks like here in sun city get to, to give you an idea we're about um 10 minutes just north of peoria avenue around 109th avenue in sun city i'm monica garcia back to you guys I'm David Coltipiano here in Phoenix. You could just see the devastation here at this apartment complex. Look how powerful the storm was. Completely uprooted this tree and even the sidewalk was leveled off. And this was a very large tree. As you can see up above, this hit the balconies uh, of some units here, but we're being told that nobody was inside. We did hear some from some people who are in some neighboring units. Take a listen. It's not like a bomb sound just went off outside. That's beyond insane. I have, like I said, I've never seen this before. Uh, and you could definitely understand why he says that. Just follow me and take a look at how enormous this tree is. Every person that drives by has their jaw dropped uh, to their car when they see what's happening out here. And uh, hey, Zeus, come back out here over here. This actually came off of the fence and actually damaged one car right here only slightly it could have been a lot worse we did see the red cross out here they're still waiting to see if people were displaced from this tree smacking into the apartment complex but we're waiting to hear back from the officials but again good news nobody is hurt from what happened here today back to you in the studio